the trailer will make him not play the game is the trailer that bad guys so here's the original final fantasy 10 2 trailer we'll watch this and uh then we'll probably watch the remaster trailer as far as what version we're gonna play of the game i don't know yet 480p oh god we're going back there boys all right so final fantasy 10 2 was released in 2003 so i was a junior in high school before i watched the trailer i don't really know what to expect because i i've always said i think final fantasy 10 had the perfect ending i thought the ending to final fantasy 10 was great so i'm not 100 sure why they made a sequel and i'm kind of nervous about what they decided to do with a sequel because i feel like the original ending for 10 was just so good i don't know what's left to go back and do in that world so I'm interested to see what the trailer looks like. And I'm also interested to see why it's so divisive in the community, because obviously a lot of people hate this game. This will be the first time I've ever seen any content for 10 2. I've never looked at a trailer, never played the game, never watched gameplay. I don't know anything about it. So here we go. Let's take a look at it. This is the original trailer. Then maybe we'll take a look at the remaster trailer. <laughs> Okay. So like one thing I noticed is the logo here. My first impression of this logo is it looks kind of like goofy and silly and not serious, which I'm either in interpreting it wrong because it's in like 480p or maybe this game just isn't as serious as other Final Fantasy games. I'm not really sure. I don't know who this character is with the sword and I don't think that's Yuna. I don't, I'm not really sure. Okay. Oh, sh what the fuck? Hold up. What? She, she's got the dual pistols. She's got the fucking Laura Croft fucking devil may cry dual. What? Who are you? This is Yuna. Okay. Okay. All right. That's a little bit different than what I expected. Saw a person that looked like you, and so she thought she saw Titus. There's Kamari again, right? Obviously, I can't read this, but I, I get the feeling that we're in our airship a lot just based on how much they're showing this early in the trailer. Okay. Oh my god. They knew that I missed Ultimecia and Square had my back. Thank you, Square. Was she in part one? She looks familiar. Oh. Bro, they do that again? Jesus Christ. Sin has disappeared in the calm. This calm. Combat looks similar to the original. What is this? Oh, we got transformations? So so we're getting like Devil May Cry guns and we're getting Sailor Moon transformations? Wow. I'm cool with it. Whoa, is this a is this new? I wonder if they bring back Titus. Like, is that what they're doing? It seems like she's on a journey to find him. She's searching for Titus. I wonder how people are gonna feel if they bring him back. Boy. Boy, if I saw Titus back in 10, I would lose my fucking mind. Wow, interesting. Let's let's watch the uh let's watch the remaster. The pilgrimages have to stop. Oh, that music. If they don't, and they get to Xanarkin, even if she defeats Sin, it will kill Yuni too, you know? Yuna, she knew what she I love that they I love that they started with that that scene with uh Riku saying that. I love that. I will stand my ground and be strong. 
I don't know when it will be, character. but someday I will conquer it. Before we get into this, Yuna was such a good character. I think Yuna's one of the best characters in like the history of Final Fantasy. Um, Yuna's probably in my top three. She might be number one. So I'm kind of like I'm looking at the the double pistols that I see in the original trailer for this game and her like animations and like the way her mannerisms seem different. I'm like, what did you do to Yuna? Like Yuna's one of the best characters ever in video games for me. Like, bro, I, please tell me you didn't ruin Yuna. Sin is gone. The calm is here. I thought our peaceful days would never end. What? The Colossus you saw is known as Vegnagun. The eternal calm. Was... I can feel it crumbling, falling no, away from the No, was she on stage feet. doing a pop song? You want to get killed? We have no choice. Why is this happening? I wish you were here with me. What? The first half of the trailer perfectly sums the, sums up the vibe of 10 and then what the fuck is this switch but someday i will conquer it sin is gone the call no 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 what is this is she a pop star the calm is here what and what is this who is shooting them what is this I thought what what are we doing what What's happening? Like at the end of Final Fantasy X, she's kind of giving this speech to all the people and she looks like she's kind of like in this like leadership role. But then you, you get this like pop star, Britney Spears, Christina Aguilera thing going on mixed with like this like kind of Charlie's Angels vibe going on with the girls. Yeah, um, wow. That's a whole different vibe. I don't know how to feel about this. This looks very different. When I look at Final Fantasy VII Remake and Rebirth, right? In my opinion, I felt like it was very true to the original in terms of like the tone. This seems like the opposite. Like look how dark and grim and dingy it is. And then you get over here and you know, like it's a whole different vibe. The music is completely different locations look different um new characters which is fine it, you know like scenes like this look like it might kind of harken back but i just get the feeling that tend to goes in a dramatically different dramatically different direction than 10. yeah i'm very curious about what this game is i'm very curious about the tone of the game the story of the game i'm really interested in the why why was this game made why does this game exist and how much does it add to or change uh you know what they accomplished with the original game like yuna's yuna clearly has developed a lot or develops a lot in Ten Two, i guess I'm kind of excited about it because I feel like, okay, this is not going to be boring. I feel like this is definitely going to be very interesting to stream, very interesting to play. I won't say that it looks good because it looks so dramatically different that uh, I feel like we're in for another dirge experience. That's kind of the impression that I have. I have the impression that I'm in for a bit of a dirge experience here. But I'm excited to play it. I'm just going to be real with you. I'm excited to play Ten Two. I'm excited to see um, what they do with some of my favorite characters in Final Fantasy. I'm excited to see what they do with one of the best stories, in my opinion, in Final Fantasy. I can see why it's so divisive just from the trailers. But did they have fun with it or is it just bad? Or will it surprise me and actually be like be really good? I've had a lot of people come back and tell me that Ten Two has one of the best combat systems in Final Fantasy, that they thought the combat system was spectacular. So I'm kind of excited to see what improvements they made to the combat system because I wasn't, I liked Ten's combat system, but I would love to see uh, an improvement in it for sure. I always pictured Yuna as like kind of a little bit more shy and low key, a little bit maybe introverted. So this is like really catching me off guard. 
hard. Oh man, I'm excited to see what it is and what they do with it though. Um, we're gonna do Detroit Become Human first, and then we'll start Final Fantasy X-2. I'm I'm excited to to see what they did here because it looks like a lot of things, but it doesn't look boring. We'll we'll probably start this game within two weeks, and I'm excited for it. Where did that even come from? <laughs>